Kansas City News, everywhere. It's, it's unfortunate that we don't have enough um, accessible washrooms that promote that human dignity that we truly all deserve. The city setting up public restrooms for fans along the Red Mile has some wondering why public bathrooms aren't more available in the city. Everyone deserves the right to use the washroom in, 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 in peace and quiet. Smith says that it's great that there are these temporary washrooms along 17th Avenue. He says that increased access to washroom facilities is always a great thing. But a trip out and about in the city isn't as easy for many, including those who are pregnant or have an inflammatory bowel disease. I've always had to kind of take that extra step from the rest of my friends to make sure that if I had to jolt to a washroom, I had the chance. McIsaac has lived with Crohn's for nearly 17 years and says a lot of people don't realize just how many people have to plan their days around knowing where public washrooms are. When the flames aren't playing, these temporary washrooms are locked and zip tied. I, I would need both hands to count uh, um, the amount of times I've had to walk in with the $5 bill, basically prepay for the cheapest item just to use the washrooms. A luxury those experiencing homelessness can't afford. Unfortunately, uh, when you look like a person experiencing homelessness, you often become targeted as an unwanted guest uh, in a facility that any of us truly could access. The city says they have publicly accessible washrooms in all city buildings, as well as 11 locations inside Zone 8, the area inside of Memorial, Deerfoot, Glenmore, and Crowchild. Of those washrooms, one is closed for construction. Most are closed in the winter, and most are also closed past sunset. Now, this one behind me in Tompkins Park is one of the only automated and 24-7 washrooms in Calgary. It just happens to be closed right now. Smith says there is more that the city and business owners can do to ensure Calgarians are able to use a washroom in peace. You know, encourage um, the public to just remember that people experiencing homelessness, um, they can safely use your washroom and that can be okay. In Calgary, Jillian Code, City News.